All right, so first off, I thought I would see if I could improve my armor. All right, well, I don't have enough adhesive, but there's, I always forget. Okay, so I can make adhesive if I can get corn and mute fruit. see what I have over here. I think I have one mute fruit. Yeah. Hmm. Is no one working on this? No? Supposedly. That one no one's working on, but I don't care. But this isn't harvestable. Strange, because I thought it's been a long time since I planted this, so I'm surprised it hasn't sprouted a mute food or whatever. And I don't have any corn. All right. Well, then I think I'm going to uh, head over to first complete this quest, and then I'll go do Corvega, and I'll take my. Power armor. Okay, it's been a while since I played, so I don't remember my loadout. side. Or on the far side. There he is. Any luck finding that locket? I've got that locket back for you. You serious? That's great news. Connie's gonna be speechless. I'm sure she'll go lean on her prices after what you've done. And feel free to use our workshop. Least we can do. All right. So I guess I should see where these guys stand. So they've got everything they need except defense. Hmm. So what are they currently doing? She's doing food. 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 Okay, they're all doing food. But I could have one guy, one person doing guard posts. I don't have any oil here. I don't have much wood or steel either. I guess I'm going to run around scrapping. Alright, I think that's enough scrapping. I don't really like scrapping all their... The, all the possessions they could legitimately use, so... I'll just, uh... Slap these down. And let's have you. Okay.
Oh, he's automatically doing all of them. Okay. Okay, so I think that takes care of the beds. Defense, power, water, food, people. Alright, so let's quit doing this. Dump any junk that I've got. Alright, good enough. I think I've got all the stuff that's likely to be valuable. Alright, so now I want to go to Corvega. Somewhere around here is the drive-in theater. I'm thinking it's here. And on the way to the drive-in theater, there's a... Yeah, there's like a diner. And if I pass some speech checks, I get... two people that I can trade with. Problem is my charisma is really bad. I don't have any drugs that would help with that. Alright, well I guess I'm just gonna head over there and accept what happens. I suspect I'm going to have to kill the drug dealer and his bodyguard. Huh. Surprised the headshot wouldn't kill them. This one didn't react. Shoot. Wow, <laughs> oh, there's one more. I can't find the ones I killed. Oh, there we go. The radstag meat, when you cook it, will give you temporary ability to carry more. So, I'm somewhat interested in having a bit of that. Something over there. Sounded like a bug. What is that? It's just an old car. Yeah, the other rad stack should be over here. Oh, there it is.
Guess I'll head towards this tent icon on my compass. I don't remember what it is. Guess the other enemy. Hmm. It's not on my compass, so it shouldn't be inside. Hmm. I wonder if it's maybe that rad stag from a while ago. too much stuff because <clears throat> I'm still planning on raiding Corvega. Root cellar. Hmm. I don't think I ever went into this place. something in here. Just got the one grenade. Hmm. I guess that's what I was hearing. activity.
I think this has to be it. Sweet. Got it. <laughs> Electrical tower. Certainly been killed or detained. For the good of my country. Wow, okay, well, <laughs> that was a lot of effort for seemingly nothing. Now I gotta finish looting this place and get out of here before I take too much radiation. This. Yes! Alright, let's go. Wasteland Survival Guide, I didn't even look closely at what it did. So, maybe this was worth it, maybe not. I didn't really look at any of the stuff that I picked up because I was trying to do it quickly. I think I already had the mini nuke from before. I don't know. <sighs> okay, well, let's continue on. Let's take a look at my radiation. Do I have anything I can eat? Yeah, may as well do this. Okay, so then there's something else on my compass. I guess I'll go toward it. Just a place with a creepy glow, I guess. Gunfire. Right, okay, so that's the diner. And that's where Trudy and somebody else are having a standoff. And we will see if I'm able to pass the speech check we and deal, get them Trudy. both or have to kill Hand them. Over the goods you owe us. I ain't giving you poison shilling chem pushers anything. Do you know what that junk has done to my boy? Whoa, whoa, easy there, Mr. Power Armor. This doesn't involve you. That's a simple business dispute, got it? Trudy's sitting on a pile of goods that she owes me. I tried reasoning with her. But it looks like I gotta take what's mine by force. Wanna make some easy money? Help me out. I could use another gun. Or maybe you think you can talk some sense into her. 
I'll talk to her. Maybe we can work this out. I appreciate it. If things go sideways, we'll back you up. <coughs> I saw you in that poison cellar talking. Well, he ain't getting his money. Period. Why? What's this all about? Oh, that Ken Pusher didn't tell you? He got my boy hooked on Jet, sold him a ton of junk on credit, and now he expects me to pay him off. That bastard ain't getting a single damn cap from me. Look, you owe the money. If you just pay them, then this'll be over. Everyone walks away without getting hurt. All right, I'll pay. Nice. But that bastard ain't gonna sell one more drop of Jet to my boy. You hear that, Wolfgang? You'll get your damn money, but I better not catch you selling chems to my boy again. Fine by me, Trudy. Your son's broke as shit anyhow. All right. Crisis is over. If you're here to trade, step up to the counter. Hey there. We're open for business again. A little lighter in the pocket, thanks to you. How about you buy something and make it up to us? Let's see what you have. A little bit of everything. We get paid and I don't even gotta shoot nobody. Good job. Here. Now how about I show you all the pick-me-ups I have to offer? Sure. Let's take a look. Now remember, moderation. All right, and that restored my health, including the radiation damage. I really, I swear they changed that because in the past, yeah, like maybe in 1.4 they changed that. All right, let's see about level up. <clears throat> I've pretty much forgotten what kind of build I wanted to do. So we've done commando, rifle, armor, armor, gun nut. See, I need to be working towards ninja. Yeah. So I'm gonna start boosting agility. So with that, I can see that I'm near the, I mean, I know I'm near the movie theater, so I'll go in that direction. And the movie theater has a workshop that maybe I can just take control of, because I know Preston will send me here, but I suspect I can just go here. I also know that there are mole rats here. I don't see any right now. And the screen there I can go into, but there are some traps. So let's see about these mole rats. Alright, if they're not above ground, I'm not sure what will trigger them to come out if I'm sneaking. See, that's one right there, isn't it? Yes. like two feet or something. 
<laughs> I didn't know that that would work. Okay, so now they're popping out. damage to me. Get a uh, stim pack, I guess. Or maybe I'll do this. some. Let's see if I can take this over. So before I get out of the power armor, I know that one thing I need to do is scrap the buckets that are down here. Or radioactive barrels. take too much damage from that. Now, I'm tempted to get it out of the power armor, but I'm also concerned I'm going to screw up and get myself killed on the traps that are here, so I guess I really should go through here first. I think there's more mole rats.
fusion core. Always welcome. I really thought there was at least one mole rat around here somewhere. Maybe not. Alright, now I know there are traps here. Just don't remember what they are. Or where exactly. And I think I can survive whatever the trap is because of the power armor. I really thought there was one more trap up there. I'm still pretty sure there's at least one more trap somewhere around here. Okay, I guess not. So there was just the one trap here, the mine, and now may as well scrap some things while I'm walking. some traps in here. Those radios are annoying. Uh, I'm paranoid about YouTube flagging it for copyright BS. So it's like, I feel compelled to try to go turn it off as quick as I can, but I don't want to get my character killed.
Alright, I know that trap on the door is not the end. See, I have the vague sense that there's a mine somewhere in that pile of trash. And if it's someplace, like if it's not in there, Okay. Hmm. Well, see, I bet I can get that from the outside. I think that takes care of the one that I remember being here. Okay. And then... Well, I don't know. I, I thought there was more traps in that other location, and there wasn't, so... Who knows if there is up here. My memory's saying yes, but I've been wrong so many times. Yeah, I don't think there's anything more here. Now in my previous game, there seemed to always be an enemy right over there. Every time I would come here, something would have spawned there. So I'm surprised there's nothing there right now. Alright, so I think I've eliminated all the danger. I'm gonna go ahead and get out of my power armor and then start scrapping. deal here is there's two guys named Art. And the one who's standing is going to accuse the one who's kneeling of being a synth. And I think the one who's kneeling is a synth. And in my first playthrough, 
I killed the guy who was standing because he was being so aggressive. But I think this time I'm going to let him execute the guy who's kneeling since I think he is a synth. You can't do this! Anyone, please! Help! No more from you. You're not replacing me. Oh, God. It's gonna kill me! Shut your mouth, or I swear I'll shut it for you. Please! You gotta help me! This guy's a synth, and he, he's gonna kill me and replace me and my family! Oh, God. My kids! Don't you dare bring them up! He's the synth, and he wants to replace me! Please! Please, you gotta believe me! You can't let that thing do this! I don't know if it'll... He'll do it if I just wait. Can't seem to talk to him. Oh. Hey, I'm on your side. I just need you to tell me the truth. Then maybe I can help. I'm telling you, I'm not a synth. You have to believe me. This is none of my business. No. You can't. He's gonna kill me. It's done. All right. And I could use this corn. Hi. The Institute. They're monsters. I wonder if he would have been more friendly if I said kill him already, but all right, so that was what I wanted to see there. Okay, so I finished scrapping all that stuff, and I want to continue toward Corvega. I think I'm going to end up ending the episode when I get near there, but uh, I'll just finish walking in that direction. I see. It's over that way. <laughs> yes, power core. I'm trying to remember if this building I see here... No, I don't think it's part of Corvega. I don't remember what it is, though. Let me see if I can get it on my map, at least. I 
see. That's the city as a whole, not this building. Quite where to go to get the building. Hmm. Preacher. I wonder if these guys are gonna try to rob me. We commit our friend, Blake, to the earth. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. May he find peace with the Lord. Amen. Would anyone like to say anything before we move on? Blake was a great guy and an even better friend. He was taken from us too soon. But he won't be forgotten. Blake, I hope you know how I felt about you. Even if I couldn't say it to your face. Now you're gone, and it seems too late. But I love you. Marcus, do you have anything to say? This is stupid. People die every day. I don't understand why. Understand. <laughs> God, why did it have to be him, huh? Why wasn't it me? <laughs> I'm the asshole of the group. I'm the one had it coming, not him. Not Blake. I'm sorry, guys. I just... I miss him as well. We all miss him, Marcus. He was the best of all of us. Thanks, guys. <clears throat> I'm okay now. Really, I am. Okay. That's it. There's nothing else we can do now. Time to move on. <laughs> yeah? <clears throat> huh? Yes? Huh? Hi. Yes? Okay. Huh? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Suddenly everybody's Scooby Doo. Hmm, super duper mart. Alright, I think this is as good a place as any to go ahead and end the episode, and in the next one, I'll go over to Corvega.